Hey, it's summer. We get ice cream. It's the good Splatfest we wanted since the start of the game, with a little twist. A tasty twist. Oh, Nintendo, they pulled the oldest trick in the book. The old Splatfest during the Nintendo Direct trick. But I see them. This Splatfest going on from Friday, July 14th at 8 p.m. Eastern Time to Sunday, July 16th at 8 p.m. Eastern Time asks you which ice cream flavor is the best. Vanilla, strawberry, or the best one, aka mint chocolate chip. The people, they clamor, they ask, but where is the chocolate flavor? In the chips? <laughs> I mean, hey, we had a whole honkin' chocolate splatfest, so I guess Deep Cut had to improvise. I'll look the other way, because the mint color looks really, really, really good against the light yellow and pink colors. It's possibly the prettiest Splatfest we've had yet, so I love it. Just give me one second, and I'll get back to explaining why I think mint chocolate will win. Did you know that mint has an alternative definition meaning cool? We are actually the coolest team, and not just because we have an ice cream Splatfest. Mint flavor is everywhere. You got it in gum, you've got it in candies, you've got it in ice cream, you've got it in plants. And yeah, 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 I, I know, I know the other two do as well, but a quick Google search shows you how hard it is to grow your own vanilla. Look at the time investment, look at the steps, and strawberries? Unless you're growing your own ones indoors, you're mostly growing a summer fruit. You Google search how to grow mint, and you get stuff saying it's one of the easiest plants to grow. Yes, and it's a little bit invasive, meaning it's perfect when we're trying to talk about how we should be invading the other teams to get some more players on our side. You could say this team was meant to be. <laughs> look, look, I've even got a mint green umbrella in my car. I'm ready to go. Warn your innocent vanilla bean enjoying friends that this is not your vanilla bean ice cream. This is regular vanilla. No cookie dough chunks in there either. No Reese's Pieces, no M&Ms, just regular old ice cream. How do you fix that, you ask? Of course, by swapping a team mint chip, where they'll not only get bonus flavor, but also that little extra bit of taste from the chocolate chips. Yeah! Strawberry ice cream is so unpredictable. Like, how big are the chunks? What's the consistency like? How artificial is that strawberry flavor? Ugh. What are the strawberries like? Are they chunks or real fruit? Are my allergies gonna flare up the moment I take a bite if they're real strawberries? Too many questions. Sorry, strawberry, but I cannot strawberry to pick that team. Ep, 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 ep. Use these questions to your advantage to bring more of those to be strawberry enjoyers to our side of the playing field. Listen, the grass is greener on the other side and we literally have the greenest ink. Okay, okay, hear me out. I don't have the best track record for Splatfests, okay? I lost three and then I won one. I have lost three again since. You know what that means, right? Simple pattern recognition. It's fate. I will win. So join me and you'll win too. Yes, that is exactly how it works. Yes. Also with these colors, Barnacle and Dime at night is gonna be gorgeous. The map is already so pretty and they recently fixed a lot of the lag issues on this map. So they're ready to go to make it a Splatfest map. Sorry, Eeltail Alley. You have to wait again another time. <laughs> So when the time comes to vote, you know to vote for Team Mint Chip. Be sure to subscribe to see us become winners. Yes, thank you for listening, and I hope you have a good one. Dare I even say, a mint day? Eh? Eh? Eh?